What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Samsung has started rolling out a brand new update for the Galaxy S22 series. I've got the Galaxy S22 Ultra here which has got this update. This is the security patch for September 2023. And apparently, Samsung has also started rolling out the beta version of One UI 6.0 for the S22 series. I'm not really sure about this, I read it in one of the articles on the internet. So if you have got the beta version of One UI 6.0 on any of the S22 series that you're using, do let me know in the comment section. Usually Samsung test the latest iteration of One UI on the latest flagship phones and they also release the beta program and they test the beta program on the previous gen phone as well like we have seen in the past. So we are expecting the beta version to come on the S22 series as well. It seems that Samsung has pushed this update in some of the regions but I'm not very sure. If you have got the update do let me know in the comments section. For now on my device I don't see any banner for the uh, One UI 6.0 on the Samsung members application but yes as soon as I get the update I will keep you guys posted so be sure to subscribe to the channel. Now coming back to the September patch, I don't see any new features here. Uh, it talks about the device stability improvements and bug fixes and uh, the version number ends with CWH6 and as you can see the size is about 389.60 MB. It's not a huge update as such, it is a basic security patch and if you're wondering whether you would receive this uh, new camera feature with 2x zoom on the S22 series, we haven't got this yet. This feature was released on the S23 series some time ago and we were expecting this feature to land on the S22 series as well but for some reason Samsung is not releasing this. Now this is definitely something bad about Samsung even if the previous gen phone is capable of getting a new feature sometimes they don't really release it or they release it after a long time. I really feel that Samsung should release all these new features at least on the flagships previous generation phones if they are capable of handling those features. You let me know what do you think about it in the comment section. Now coming to the S23 Ultra's battery life this phone has been decent even though it is not as good as the Galaxy S23 Ultra. Uh, this phone can last a day without any issues but yes the battery life could have been better on a device like this with 5000 mAh battery for sure. You guys let me know what is your screen on time, how is your battery performance on your S22 Ultra or any other Samsung Galaxy phones that you're using. Do mention the model and let me know the screen on time on your device that would be interesting to check out. And as far as the stability on this device is concerned it's pretty good. I don't see any hanging or stuttering issues on this phone. It is running buttery smooth without any issues. That is all I wanted to share with you guys. If at all we get the beta version of One UI 6 on the S22 series I will keep you guys posted I will post a video on this particular topic so stay tuned for that and be sure to subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you find this informational and if you're interested in this wallpaper on the home screen you can download it by clicking the link in the description. I do leave a link for the new wallpapers in each and every video I post. So if you're interested in wallpapers, you can go ahead and check out all my previous videos. You will get to download a new wallpaper from the description. Go ahead and check it out. And you can also stay tuned for all the upcoming videos with the new wallpapers. You can download them from the description. That's about it. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.